breathe again, I can see again I can feel how it feels to be free again I can dream again, I believe again Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Friend Neighborhood Gamer Neon Spider Here doing a gameplay of WWE 2K14, ladies and gentlemen It seems like you guys are loving these WWE gameplays I've been seeing a lot of views on it Um... And I'd like to thank you guys for 16 subscribers. I very appreciate it. I'm trying to get to 20 right now. And that's like my goal right now is to get to 20. My main goal on YouTube is to actually get to 50 subscribers. 50 or probably like 100 subscribers. That's my goal. But my main goal right now is to 20. If you guys can help me out there, smash that like button. Subscribe to me if you guys enjoy this content. And I'll make sure I'll keep bringing this. I'll keep giving it to you guys whenever you guys want. I'll put more gameplays of other games on my on my channel but for right now it's just gonna be WWE it's just gonna be WWE demos of games um Spider-Man and probably some other new games that's gonna come out probably Dead Space I might do a co-op of it I don't know I need I still need to get somebody to play that with me but if you guys can find somebody to play that with me or if you guys know if you guys want to play it with me or whatever then feel free my PSN will be in the description below and you guys can play with me you guys can Help me out with it. It'll be, it'll be my first time playing. Sorry, I just stuck it right there. I don't know why. It'll be my first time playing Dead Space 3. So, um, help me out a little bit, alright? I did play a little bit of it. Um, yeah, and also I'd like to thank you guys for helping my friend Angel come on getting a lot of subscribers. He has right now 43 subscribers. Keep subscribing to him, keep liking his videos, keep watching him. We need all the likes, subscribes, we need all the comments you guys can give to us. It would really help us out, and we'll really appreciate it. So, seems like you guys are liking this WWE gameplay. So we're not going to do universe mode right now. We're going to be doing 30 years, WrestleMania. Not the story mode, we're going to be doing Undertaker. We're going to be doing the Undertaker, the feet, the streak. We're going to be doing Defeat the Streak with The Undertaker. Alright, here we go. We got statistics. You, you can already see I already did some of it. My high score right now is 77,545 on Defeat the Streak. On Defend the Streak, my score is 94,692. Alright, now here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to Defeat the Streak. We're going to play it. And hopefully we get to beat it. Uh, who are we gonna be this time? Who are we gonna be right now? I'll be my creative care. I'll be like one of the creative characters probably in five videos because I kind of want to work with the regular characters right now. So I'll be my I'll be creative characters in like five videos later. All right. So right now we're going to be hey, let's be the guy who came back who just came back to WWE. Let's be Chris Jericho. Let's see how he does. I've been understanding that people have been saying it. I've been seeing it on other gameplays. People have been saying that Undertaker's defeat the streak is super easy. I want to see. I want to see it for myself actually. All right, we got the arena. We're gonna turn the entrances off and we're gonna start it. Here we go. Alright, here we go. Look at Undertaker and Chris Jericho staring each other in the eye. Re they're ready to kick this one off. This is going to be fun to watch. Here we go. That's Chris Jericho going with some chain wrestling, but no, Undertaker. Trying to get a reversal in there. Chris Jericho not letting it happen. Up on the top rope, here goes Chris Jericho. Is he going to land it? No, Undertaker with a reversal. Undertaker steps out of the way, hits him with DDT with that counter. Oh my gosh. The crowd is cheering on Taker. The crowd wants Taker to win this streak. The crowd wants Taker to defeat Jericho. And also, you guys, if you guys want to also see some good WB content, like WB storylines, scripts, and a lot of cool stuff, look at WEDF Fan Nation. They do a lot of cool things. They've been very good with their storylines. Just, just check them out. I know, I know they're. I check them out. They're good. Um, they recently uploaded a video called Armageddon, or was it? I think it was Armageddon. Their, um, their WrestleMania is going to be coming very soon, 
So please stay tuned for them for that. And I'll really appreciate that if you guys can go check them out. Also, can you guys go check out Brandon Plays? Brandon Plays is also good. He does also WWE content. It's Chris Jericho. Oh my gosh, that neck breaker. Brandon Plays also does WWE content. He does it really well. He recently had a WrestleMania. It was very good. It was actually this match right here. Chris Jericho going up against The Undertaker. Undertaker sadly won it. I was very disappointed. But yeah, guys, go check him out. And last but not least, guys, can you go check out the other, my other YouTuber who I subscribed to, the other YouTuber who I subscribed to was, oh my gosh, I think it was Kino, Kino Plays, I think his name was, um, just type it in in the search bar, it's K-A-N-O, and then Plays, I think it is, just go search it up, go to his channel, he needs some views, he has like 200 subscribers right now, please give him more subscribers, he needs help, and... I think he's a recent YouTube maker like me, so just get so just lend him a hand, like his videos, comment, do it, do whatever you guys can, cause he does a lot of great videos. He plays Universe Mode with his character Big T. He does other gameplays as well, and it's very, it's very nice. All right, and Chris Jericho's out on the outside here. Here goes Undertaker stomping on Chris Jericho's leg. If Undertaker can get Chris Jericho's legs, he won't be able to hit the Code Breakers. They on it on the outside. Here he goes. Undertaker made a bad move there. Undertaker got up. Chris Jericho going for the walls. But Chris Jericho needs to do this to Undertaker inside of the ring. Chris Jericho, what are you doing? You need to do this to Undertaker inside of the ring. Undertaker fighting out. But Chris Jericho lets go of the hold. Oh my gosh. Seems like the only way you can beat Undertaker in this, in this matchup here is to keep him outside as long as you can. That's, Chris, that's what Chris Jericho is trying to do. Chris Jericho, what are you looking for? Chris Jericho! Just speared Undertaker right through the barricade, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my gosh, now what's Chris Jericho looking for now? Taking the announcer's table equipment off. Chris Jericho's looking to put Undertaker through that announcer's table. Here it goes. Up on the announcer's table, Undertaker get up on too. Undertaker's on. Reversal! Oh my gosh, right through the table. Chris Jericho is laid out, ladies and gentlemen. There's no way Chris Jericho can get up after that, but he's back up. Undertaker with his signature. Will Undertaker be able to hit the close? Not the clothesline. Will Undertaker be hit the be able to hit the choke slam here? Undertaker coming for Chris Jericho. Chris Jericho is not going to let Undertaker win this matchup. Chris Jericho has vowed to the Undertaker that he would defend. He would defeat his streak, not defend it. He would defeat it, ladies and gentlemen. As Chris Jericho picks up Undertaker, trying to do whatever he can. Will he do it again? Sends Undertaker back outside of the ring. Telling Undertaker to get out of his ring, stay out of his life. And that's just what. Oh my gosh, look at that. Now here goes Chris up on the top rope. No misses. That should hurt his elbow. Get some elbow surgery after that. Oh my gosh, Undertaker. Undertaker holds Chris Jericho up. Going for the Tombstone Pile Driver. It connects. The Tombstone Pile Driver. Oh my gosh, Chris Jericho is out. Legend. One more of those. Chris Jericho could be done for. Chris Jericho could be done for if he Undertaker hits one more of those. Oh my gosh. And then Chris Jericho takes down Undertaker. Still taunting the Undertaker. Still making sure Undertaker knows who he's messing with. Know who he's dealing with. Look at Chris Jericho right now. Chris Jericho going back inside of the ring. Now Chris Jericho. Oh my gosh. Right on the steel steps. Both Undertaker and Chris Jericho are down. But somehow Undertaker got right back up. Now look at this. Undertaker and Chris Jericho on the outside. Chris Jericho throws Undertaker back inside of the ring here. What are these two looking for? Look at Undertaker trying to go for something. But oh my gosh. Going for the cover. One, two, kick out by Chris Jericho. That could have been close right there. We could have lost this match. Oh my gosh. Look at this. I will be putting a website up of my... I will be putting a website up very soon. Probably in the near future. Putting a website up so you can guys go into the forums. You know, you guys can check it out. Here goes Undertaker going for the cover again. Three right there, Chris Jericho. Oh my gosh. Chris Jericho loses. I think we have time for another match. That match was not that good, ladies and gentlemen, you guys know. I did not mean to lose that. I'm, I'm sorry, I suck. <laughs> I suck so bad at Chris Jericho. Uh, if it was somebody else, I probably would have won it. But, like, I don't know. Chris Jericho cannot keep Undertaker down for the three count. 
ladies and gentlemen, it was impossible for Chris Jericho to keep him down. But at least Chris Jericho did some type of damage to The Undertaker. I did not get a decent score, but I did get something, ladies and gentlemen. I did get redemption. We're going to go to defeat the streak once more. We're going to do... Okay, can I randomize it? Uh, no, I can't randomize it. Okay, we're going to go with... Let's see, who we're going to go with. We're going to go with actually Roman Reigns for this one. Actually, we're going to do Roman Reigns for this one. I actually changed this move. His Superman, his, his Superman punch actually looks like a Superman punch now. It doesn't look like a jumping clothesline like Kofi Kingston does. It actually looks like a freaking um, Superman punch. Turn entrances off, and now uh, here we go. Hopefully I, get, hopefully I get to win this with Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns, hopefully. Um, if I don't, it'll, it'll be a well hard, well hard, blah, blah, blah. It'll be a well hard fought battle. Yeah, make sure you guys subscribe to me because if you guys subscribe to me, it'll give me money. It'll give me money from YouTube and I need to eat. Give me money for food. Just act like you give me a donation. One, one subscription equals a donation. Ladies and gentlemen. And, you know, I need to eat food. I need clothes. I need I need stuff. I need stuff that you guys can use. My favorite food is like... So my favorite food is like ribs or other crap. And I also like a lot of Mountain Dew. I like a lot of Mountain Dew and lemonade. So if you subscribe to me, you like my videos, that will feed me. So pretend that you're feeding me by subscribing to me. Pretend that I will go hungry. I would just, I, I would, like, I don't know. I would get dehydrated. I'll die from hunger if you guys don't subscribe to me. So please, please, I don't want to live without food, please. And yeah, Roman Reigns taking it. Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns taking it to Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns taking it to The Undertaker, excuse me. Now here we go. It's, oh my gosh, no, Undertaker with a reversal. Roman Reigns gets clotheslined by The Undertaker in the corner there. Now here he goes, Roman Reigns knocks down Undertaker. Showing The Undertaker who the alpha dog is in this matchup. If this match really happens, ladies and gentlemen, well, this match could have happened if Undertaker would have kept his streak if, stupid, if the stupid WWE didn't mess up their storylines, but I thought Sting, like... You, you would think Sting would come back to face Undertaker at WrestleMania, but he doesn't. He comes back just to not do anything. I don't know what they're gonna do with the storyline. Like, what, what would, what would they do with Sting's storyline now that Undertaker's streak is gone by Brock Lesnar, or by Brock Lesnar, I should say, in the words of Paul Heyman, <laughs> as Undertaker slams down Roman Reigns. Look at this, Roman Reigns putting up a good hard fight. Look at that. Oh, that was a Superman punch, but I don't have my signature, so I should change that. <laughs> oh, man. Look at Roman Reigns. Oh, my gosh. Roman Reigns is not putting up much of a fight for The Undertaker. Roman Reigns wants to keep this match inside of the ring. Oh, my gosh. Roman Reigns wants to keep this match inside of the ring. What do you guys think that Sting is going to do when he comes back? Do you think Sting's going to do a tag team? Do you think Sting's going to freaking go for the belt as soon as he comes back? That's usually what people do. Oh my gosh, there goes Roman Reigns gets knocked down by The Undertaker. Look at this. As Roman Reigns trying so hard. And if you guys watch TNA, um, you guys saw last night that Matt Hardy came back to wrestling. Matt Hardy came back wrestling, he's back, and he's back with his brother. At Destination X, you're going to be seeing Jeff Hardy and Matt Hardy, the Hardy brothers, going up against... Uh, another tag team. I don't know who they're. I don't know who, what they're called. I think they're called the Wolves, something Wolfpack or something. I don't know. But just watch TNA. It's getting very interesting, actually. It's Roman Reigns with that Superman punch. Look at that. That Superman punch. Should I show it to you again? I don't think I can. No, I can't. Never mind. Superman punch by Roman Reigns. R Roman Reigns, what are you looking for here? Looking for a spear to Undertaker through the table. That should be it. That is it. This, you can call this match down the middle. That That is it. Undertaker got hit. That spear threw the announcer's table. I learned that move from Angel. Come on. Angel taught me that move online, and I've been using it. It's been very helpful. As Undertaker kicks out the count of one. Remember, this is WrestleMania. This is his arena. He does win mostly at these arenas. As Undertaker, here we go. Picks Roman Reigns up. Holds him up going for the last ride. And it connects. Look at that. The last ride by The Undertaker. Going for the cover. One kick out by Roman. And goes Roman. Oh my gosh, Roman runs out of the way. 
Roman needs to find a way to get out of the ring before Undertaker hits the Tombstone Pile Driver. And there he exits out of the ring, buying himself some time here. Oh my gosh. Remember, this is a no holds barred. These competitors can do whatever they want in this match. These competitors can these competitors can go backstage. These competitors can like go home or something. It's no holds barred. They can use any weapon they they can find. No holds barred means no holds barred. I think it looks like he's setting Roman Reigns up for the Tombstone Pile Driver. Too fast. Oh my gosh. Here he goes. Undertaker hitting the Tombstone Pile Driver. This could be it if Roman Reigns. If Undertaker gets Roman Reigns back inside of the ring, it can be over for Roman. It can be over for Roman if he gets back inside of the ring. But Roman playing possum there. Roman playing possum. Roman knew what Undertaker was trying to do, and he was playing possum. He was waiting for that moment to strike, but it looks like that moment. Came a little bit too fast. One kick out by Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns is not giving up. Roman Reigns wants to defeat that undefeated streak. That undefeatable streak of The Undertaker. Now here we go. Roman Reigns. No. Undertaker reversal. And Roman Reigns cannot get to reverse anything in this match. Roman Reigns is having a really hard time catching up with The Undertaker. And then The Undertaker with a leg drop. Undertaker has another signature move. Will he hit it? Undertaker, here he goes. Hopefully I get to be by the ropes, please. Let me be by the ropes, please. Ah, oh, last ride by the Undertaker. That could be for Roman. One, two, three. That's it. I'm sorry. I can't, I can't beat Undertaker. If I, if I picked Brock Lesnar, I could have beat him, though. I bet. Oh, my gosh. Well, probably next time, the next video, we'll probably beat him. Next video, we'll probably pick somebody who can actually have, have a chance against Undertaker. Oh my! I'm sure you guys can do better against Undertaker. I didn't stay out the ring that much. Cause I didn't want to be a a wuss or whatever, whatever you guys want to call it. Cause I didn't want to stay outside the ring, use weapons on Undertaker all the time, and just you know, just get the win off of weapons. I don't want to do that. I want to beat him legit. I want to beat him inside the ring at all times. But I use the announcer table for a reason, just to keep him down for a long time. But anyways. My name, is, my name is your friend, Neighborhood Gamer Neon Spider. Next episode, we'll probably pick somebody who's good enough to be Undertaker. Roman Reigns was good, but I could not beat him legit. So we're going to have to pick somebody else. And, you know, I will see you all later.